Ah, shiny Lapras. You are so rare. That purple color look good on you. You're useful in PvP. And most of all, you are extremely rare. Not a lot of people in the entire world have you. And I was one of the very few that do. And I did not have to go to Sentosa, Singapore to get you. I love this shiny Pokemon. Because again, it is extremely rare. And since they removed it from the field research, I am so lucky to have you in my collection. I mean, just look at you. Wow. wow. Just wow. wow. I am so in love with this shiny Pokemon. What? This is my best shiny I got in the collection right Hello? What do you mean Shiny Lapras is coming back and is going to have his own raid day? Get out of here! Somebody gonna have to pay for this. Alright ladies and gentlemen of the YouTube citizens, y'all know who this is. This is your boy True Inferno and today's date is Friday, May the 17th. With some breaking news, although technically I think everybody should be aware of this, but you get the point. Breaking news. This has been a minute since I came at you guys with some bre uh, breaking news video, rather. And this one is big. This one really, really big. Now, whether it's good or bad, depending on who you're asking. I mean, but either way, it's still major. Let's get straight into it. So, Extraordinary Raid Week is here, folks. So start your, or really, jumpstart your summer with Extraordinary Raid Week. So let's take a look at this. Trainers, get ready for the summer with a special week of events. Prep your best teams and get your raid passes ready for our upcoming Extraordinary Raid Week. To test your battle skills, we have a full week of exciting raids for you to show off your trainer prowess. So, the raid week will start this Tuesday, May the 21st at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and will last until the following Tuesday, May the 28th, same time, 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So here are the list of raid bosses for you guys that will be appearing all week. Tier 1 raid bosses, Machop, which can be shiny, Slack Off, Shinx, which can be shiny, and the new addition, Bronzer, which can now be shiny. Shiny Bronzer is now being added in the game. Let's move on. Tier 2, Mistrevious, which is actually kind of funny actually because the Civic Center in Dearborn is now a mischievous nest. And I don't have a shiny mischievous. Yeah. Yeah. Let's move on. Kelia, uh, I think I pronounced that correctly. Please help me out with that. Morrow, which can be shiny. Phoebus, which can be shiny. Clampro, which can be shiny. And is back. So you can get a shiny Clampro now. And Bibberell. Which is not shiny. And did I mention that Mistrevious as a raid boss can be shiny as well? Now let's move on to tier 3. Alone and Raichu, which can be shiny. Chansey, Scyther, which can be shiny. Aerodactyl, which can be shiny. And Floso. And then we got tier 4. We're looking at Alone and Melrack, which can be shiny. Dragonite, which cannot be shiny. Tyranitar, which cannot be shiny. Absol, which can be shiny. And Metagross, which cannot be shiny. So even though we got their shiny forms of Dragonite, Tyranitar, and Metagross in the game, you have to catch their pre-evolution forms. So we're talking like uh, Dratini, Lavatar, and what's the other one called? I'm, I'm drawing a blank. I, I, for, I legit forgot what that one called. But it, the name is pop up around here somewhere. So we're going to move on. You can catch those out in the route. But the evolved form shiny? No, you can't do that. Now let's move on. Bonuses, double the raid starters and double the raid XP. Now, I saw somewhere that the XP was for the raid catch, but here they're just saying the raid XP. So, if you complete the raid, you're going to get double the raid XP, which is the right move as opposed to the raid catch. Like, that's stupid. But let's move on. Ooh. Now they announced it. Wednesday, May 22nd from 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. Your local time zone. Australia, Spain, South Africa, 
Chile, Singapore, Japan, Detroit, Chicago, Vegas, Hawaii, the moon, Saturn, Jupiter, Mars, the next dimension, back in the day, back to the future, your local time zone, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. We are gonna have the legendary dinner hour, but this one gonna be different. All those legendary, man. Bro, what are you talking about, man? All those raids oh, that I mentioned, yeah. they would be spawning like crazy within the hour. They should have extended it to two hours if that was the case, but that's just me. But yeah, they're gonna be spawning like crazy. It's gonna be hard because you got, you, most of you gonna be looking for certain ones, like the bronzer would be one, the Machop may, may be the one. Yeah, I, I think I'll probably look for that one as well. Some of you may be looking for the Phoebus and the Clamp Pro. The, the Alone and Right Shoes, the Mail Racks and the Absolute, they're always there. So that's it, eh. But the Sight does most definitely. So there's gonna be certain ones I can tell that some of you guys will be looking for. And it's best to like come up with a plan in terms of which ones you wanna do or if you don't care, you wanna do them all for the starters and XP. I'm down for that. But yeah, there you go with that. Now, here's the main event right here. And this is the one that kind of got me going, uh, I don't know about this one. Lapras Ray Day. So, if you're lit, I'm, I'm going to do this backwards so I can be as clear and simple as possible. The Asia Pacific region, which includes Australia, your Lapras Ray Day is Sunday, May the 26th from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. your local time zone. Again, the Asia Pacific region, which include Australia, your Lapras Ray Day is Sunday, May the 26th, from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Everywhere else, all around the world outside of the Asia Pacific region, outside of Australia, Saturday, May the 25th, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Again, your logo time zone. So, let's take a look at the features for this Lapras Raid Day. The transport Pokemon Lapras will be joining raid battles for this event. Receive up to five raid passes from gyms at no cost. If you're lucky, oh my gosh, you may encounter a shiny Lapras. Uh, this is your chance to add some awesome Pokemon like Tyranitar or Metagross to your team. We hope you're up for the challenge trainers. Let's go raid. Okay. I'm gonna look at this with a positive attitude, why? Because I already got a shot of Lapras. But if your boy gets another shiny Lapras and you don't get one, best be prepared to offer you to offer up rather your best and your rarest shiny. If I don't have it, best be prepared to offer it up. Especially if I get more than one ooh, if I get more than one shiny Lapras and you don't get none, yeah. You got to ante up, bro. I don't care who you are. You know, you could be somebody within my local raid crew. You could be a, a YouTuber. You could be somebody who subscribed to my channel recently or back in the day. Heck, you could be Pokemon Mad Master Holly herself. You could be Pokemon Master Holly yourself. Even though I think she got a shiny Lapras, but I don't know. But you could be somebody like that. If you know how to shiny Lapras and I get another one, you, you best be prepared to offer it up, man. You got to ante up with that uh, shiny. You got to ante up with the shiny. I am going there. I am dead serious. I am going there. It's that real with me. But that's it for the news. So again, obviously the legendary. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Now you got too much dip on your chip. I keep saying legendary. The raid week starts Tuesday, May the 21st. And we're last until May the 28th, starting and ending at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. Now, before that, we do have EX raids that would be going on this weekend. I'm not sure if it's Friday and Saturday or Saturday and Sunday. Mine's a Saturday. And then, of course, speaking of Sunday, we got Community Day, where the feature Pokemon is Torchic. Now, again, let me clarify that. The exclusive move for Torchic Community Day is Blast Burn. You must evolve your Torchic all the way up to Blaziken in order to get Blast Burn. You cannot use a TM to get Blast Burn. However, you can use a TM to get Blast Kick, which is a move that would be available from Community Day on throughout. There's no, oh, you gotta get it before, no, it's, it's in the game. Like from Community Day on throughout, it would be in the game. 
So, and both of them on charge moves, so you got you got some sacrifices that you need to make. Do you choose one or the, over the other, or do you use Stardust to get both? Sacrifices must be made. That's all I got for you guys, so with that said, y'all know who this is. This is your buddy, New Jack Gatsby, a.k.a. the new CBA Smith, saying peace out, y'all, and I'll see y'all next time. Yeah. Get out of here. Bro, I'm out, man. I'm tripping. After you subscribe to the channel, make sure you click the bell icon so you never miss a new video or a live stream ever again. Thanks, guys. Living in a world where tomorrow's never promised. Last of a dime breed, red of fine honest. Got me feeling like an onyx. My heart was getting hard till I looked to the sky. Say, I'ma leave it to God and embark on this path. Journey of a life, sign. Everybody rhyme, but not a lot of cosign. Defining minds, capability.